All right, and welcome back. So the next mission here is the boss of this city. Finally, we have tracked down Bruno Borgia and we're gonna take him down. So let's go. And here we go. All right. So let's check out our gear. Smart disc, spear gun, glive, combi stick, medicomp, and vocal mimicry. All right. So Bruno Borgia will always have his shield up and while he's using an axe to attack you. So as you see, the center part of this stage has rain. If you go underneath here while you're invisible, your invisibility will get disabled. So here's the thing with Bruno Borgia. He is going to have a very high percentage of seeing you and tracking you while you are visible. So the trick here is to not fight him when he is underneath the rain. There are sometimes when he's going to stick there, but try to get his attention and draw him outside of that raining part of the stage. So as long as you are invisible, it's going to make this battle a little bit easier. So before we engage into combat with uh, Bruna Borgia, let's clear out uh, some enemies at the back here on the second floor. Collect any more items we need and there's something I want to show you. Oh, I'm getting hit by enemies. Uh, we'll get to the top. Well, there's still enemies on this floor too. Check it out. All right. There we go. They're done. Oh, there's a recharge point there. We don't need it right away. There's two extra medicomp charges here. All right. There's that one. And there are some more enemies here. Good, they're down. And in the corner there, you see another recharge point for your energy. All right, so let me just take my time here. Whoa, that was kind of weird. We still got them, yeah, that's fine. And there's some dew down here. Let me have a look at him. What is he doing? What is he doing down there? Let me just scan this dude. No armor detected. What about his mental status? Let's have a look. He's violent, Borgia family, soldier. And what weapon do you currently have in your hand? A meat cleaver. Wow. All right. All right, good. Okay, so let's go over to this area. I could take this medicomp charge now or come back later. Um. Yeah, we'll take it now. That's fine. We'll heal. And we'll take this one. This way we don't have to come back here later on. I mean, what we have now should be more than enough. So here's a little Easter egg, I guess you can call it. So in this stage, if you uh, go over here on this platform, you can zoom in to the far back and you can see Isabella, who just gave birth to her child, which is Hunter Borgia. So uh, let's lock on and change vision modes on Isabella. All right. Let's switch to the green one. This is the important one because on this vision mode, you can see the human infant body of Hunter Borgia. Yeah, that's pretty cool. What about her mental status? She is passive, Borgia family, non-hostile, dishonorable prey. You could go down here and get a much more straight view of her, but when you go down here, you're prone to attract enemies and they might come behind you and hit you at the back. So, yeah. And that should be, yep, see what I mean? All right, so let's get down to business. And uh, yeah, Bruno Borgia is once again uh, holding his ground underneath the rain area. But first, let's get rid of uh, these few enemies that are walking around. The enemies will eventually keep respawning infinitely, so the point here is get rid of Bruna Borgia as soon as you can. And we'll do a stealth kill on this one. Nice. Okay. So uh, Bruna Borgia is holding his ground down there. Enemies are starting to respawn through that open doorway. Okay. We shall remove our invisibility and uh, make ourselves known here. We'll take out these few enemies. They'll come back in a few seconds, but the point here is we got to get Bruno's attention. There we go. Got you. All right. He sees me now. All right. 
So as you can see, Bruno is staying underneath the rain. So you do not want to fight him there. You want to get his attention and draw him outward, like get him out of there. Come on, Bruno, get out of the rain, get out. Okay, so here's the thing. If he sees you when you're not invisible, he's going to be locked onto you almost all the time. I'd say maybe 90% of the time. So when you are visible to him, it's very hard to get his back. But when you are invisible, he's going to predict or try to guess where you are and do random attacks. And that's when you can actually get behind him and do some free damage. So the point here is do not fight him under the rain when you are visible. Get him outside, turn invisible and just circle him. And then when you start swinging away, get behind him and do some combos on him. Just rinse and repeat. And that is it. At the very end, rip out his skull, take that trophy and the stage is complete. You think that makes you the boss now? <laughs>